Should I get an appraisal done uh, before I list my home or before I even talk to a real estate agent? Well, it's always good to have the information. Um, and one thing that people in real estate agents are actually coaching their sellers on is to get a home inspection done prior to uh, listing their home so they know of the uh, potential issues with the house. And an appraisal can be used the same way. Um, and what's nice about using an appraiser before you speak to a real estate agent is we are an unbiased third party. So we're not trying to sell the home. We're not trying to list it. We're not trying to get it to a certain price so we can sell it easily. Um, we are telling you what a fair market value is, which is what a normal buyer and normal seller would normally agree to in an open market. Um, but also doing an appraisal beforehand can help eliminate some of the issues we've talked about on some of the earlier episodes of this uh, video, which is what counts as a bedroom? How much value does my walkout lower level that's finished count? Um, what's going on in the attic? Can the, does this count as a bedroom? Um, is it usable space? So I think some of those things can help you eliminate um, some potential issues when you list the home, but then also give you an idea of what the home may actually be worth before you put it on the market. Excellent. So, um, especially if you have a really unique property um, that, you know, an agent may not have any comps for, and it may have an outbuilding or a pool or a, some other uh, mother-in-law house on the same property that you don't have comps for, it might be a good idea to get that appraisal ahead of time. Well, and, yeah, and, and not only doing the appraisal ahead of time for your own benefit, but it also gives you something to fall back on when you're working with potential buyers mm -hmm. to say, look, here's an actual report that says what this house is worth on the open market. Excellent. Thanks, Mike. Mm -hmm.